So this video is sort of a follow-up to my last video in which I showed you how to download an image from a website, um, but can also stand alone um, in showing you how to crop an image. Okay? Because I know many times I've had projects where I've, um, I've wanted to do that. And so I'm going to explain to you a real quick and easy way to do it. So it doesn't take much code, and um, I'm going to share this code with you, though. I've already cut and pasted it into um, this existing project from the last one. This function here allows you to kind of select a section of the image and then create a new image out of that, and then we return that image. Here. I'm going to change it right here where we assign the image. So I'm going to kind of put that right there. Um, I'm going to comment out that and change this to that image one. Right? And so now we should see uh, just a small portion of me bring up. The image is, the original image is 550 by 732. So it's this top left hand corner. Let's let's put it you know somewhere in the middle here. Let's say like uh, 275, 200, something like that. And so that's the starting coordinates, and then this is the width and height. So let's see how that works. Uh, let's start it again. There you go. <laughs> that's kind of funny. All right, so you're, you're just grabbing little small parts of the image and displaying that, uh, which, you know, who knows, maybe that's something you may want to do. Um, all right, so I just wanted to show you that. 